too. Okay, what we have here is a 16 inch comparator with a quick release assembly exposed and we're going to reseat the nylon jaws inside the quick release. Um, the way you're supposed to operate this is open the quick release, move the stage to where you want it, and flick it closed after the stage is stopped. If you flick it closed while you're moving the stage, you can strip out the nylon teeth in there eventually. Um, so we're going to show you how to reseat the teeth and uh, get it working again. You can put a big flat bladed screwdriver up in the top here, uh, or you can use an Allen wrench that just fits in there. And what we're going to do is lock this into place so it's securely closed. And then I'm going to put the Allen wrench in the top of the jaws here and pry the jaws open on the top, which is going to push the nylon against the lead screw. So we'll just put a little bit of pressure there by pushing down on the Allen wrench and then twist this back and forth and then lift up on the Allen wrench to pry it the other way, twist it back and forth. You can put something in and pry it sideways as well. Um, any way to pry these top apart because once you pry the top apart, it puts pressure on the bottom. So I'm going to move it over here and get a better grip on the handle. Uh, put a lot of pressure on it and then twist the handle back and forth. And that cuts new teeth in the nylon jaws. And you can do this in a couple different spots on the stage. Make sure it's locked in good before you seat it. And then cut the teeth in. And then when you start turning this, it should be already locked in place. You shouldn't jump and lock in place. If it jumps, you're going to have to reseat it again. Uh, but that's it. That's pretty simple. Uh, just cuts the teeth in the nylon a little bit deeper. And you should be okay after that.